How's it going, everyone? We are going to be playing some Sekiro. Shadows died twice. I'm a big Dark Souls fan, so... Um, I, I, I wanted to get this going. I actually got home from work and uh, went to bed straight away. That way I could download it and play it. Get some, And that way I would, you know, not lose too much sleep for work tomorrow, so... Pray to God that I won't be too tired. Um, today... When, by the time you guys are watching it, it is today. It's about 2 in the morning, so... Let's do it. In the closing years of the Sengoku era, Japan was consumed by a perpetual conflict. The fires of war raged on, <laughs> spreading deep into the mountains, to the land of Ashima. <laughs> What's the matter, Stray? Nothing left to lose? Well, would you look at that? Fascinating. Will you join me, Starving Wolf? On that day, a young cub was taken from the battlefield. He trained relentlessly, and indeed, went on to become a Master Shinobi. Listen, Wolf. You must never forget the Shinobi Code. As your father, my word is absolute. Your master's is a close second. As of today, he is your master. Defend him with your life. If he is taken, bring him back at any cost. You understand me, don't you, Wolf? Well, um, there we go. Opening cutscene out of the way. I'm sure there will probably be another one after the loading screen, but not bad. Some 20 years after Ishin's coup, the Ashina clan was on the brink of collapse. And the shinobi, known as Wolf, had lost everything. Both the man who took him in, and the boy he had sworn to protect. Shinobi, open your eyes for the sake of your master.
Getting Dark Souls 1 vibes from that. I want to make sure I leave enough time that way everyone else can read it. Alright, so that's Crouch. This is Jump. Um, I'm pretty sure it'll. it's probably going to end up being B to run, as the last one is. Um, I'm going to go the opposite way, see if there's any items this early in the game. Um, I'm not actually sure if there are. There doesn't appear to be. It was a waste of time. So, yeah, don't don't come over here, because it doesn't look like there's anything here. All right. I always love the creator of Dark Souls for the worlds that he builds. They're... They look absolutely amazing, honestly. In case of stealth will be important. Sounds like it's that usual. That at the bottom of the well. We didn't shackle him, restrain him, nothing. That doesn't worry anybody? Not at all. Not only is he unarmed, he has completely lost his will to live. Nothing but a coward. Unworthy of our concern. The moonlight shines strongly on the Moonview Tower tonight. The Divine Heir is probably using the light for his reading again. Probably, but imprisoning a mere child. I feel sorry for the boy. Agreed. But I'm sure Lord Genichiro has his reasons. Hmm. Alright. Just kind of winging it on where I need to go. The Moonview Tower door. You can check that it's locked, right? Mm, it's certainly locked, but <laughs> nobody fixed that hole in the wall. That? Don't worry about it. The hole faces the edge of a cliff. No one could pass through it. No one except a highly skilled ninja, Shinobi. No one except a Shinobi. Okay, so Dark Souls is going a little more. Got a warish type, um, Arkham Batman maybe. I mean, I'm up for it. I like the new feel. It's very uh, um, there's a lot of vert verticality to this one now. Before, I mean, I liked, liked how you know you actually felt like you got somewhere where you had to climb up all the stairs to get to all these cool places. But also like this one where it you know you're actually climbing your way up to things. It, it's I like it. This is a pretty big hole in the wall, guys. <gasps> you did well to come here. It's been too long, Wolf. I've come to free you, my lord. Well then? Raise your head. Kusabimaru, your sword. My shinobi. In accordance with the bond of lord and retainer, you will pledge your life in my service. As you command. Huh. 
forget mercy. I don't know. Mercy's hard to come by nowadays. Loyal wolf, I see you are wounded. I have something that may help. It is a special gourd of medicinal waters. Use it to heal your wounds. My lord. Look right on it. Now then, were you gravely injured? A afterward? After what? Do you not remember that night? I do not. Hmm. No. We'll talk about it later. Right now, we must escape Ashina Castle. As you say. There's a secret passage beneath the moat bridge that will take us out of the castle. Lord Ishin told me about it once. I ask you to find that secret passage. Once you find it, hmm, signal me with a reed whistle. You know, like you used to long ago. I will join you as soon as I hear it. Okay. So this is like the Estus, I think. It's going to be a healing item. Homeward Bone, essentially, except it's Homeward Idol. Sounds good. I know some things will be like Dark Souls, some other ones won't be. Alright, yeah, it's basically, it's basically Estus. Sounds good. Gotta check everything. Okay, so they're medical pellets. I might just read it a little bit later. Moving right along, we're gonna try and see if there's anything. Oh, whoops. Sorry, I just broke all your shit. Alright, looks like we're gonna get some c c combat -ba bat Okay, so... Okay, yeah. So it is a healing item. Okay, so attacks will break the enemy's posture so I can do a death blow. Okay, okay. Um, doesn't sound too difficult. Let's do it. Actually, if he can't see me, I might just go with a stealth. Easy. Make it only down to one. Oh, that... Wow. They have no posture at all. They are not the best defenders. Alright. Sorry, I am... It is a bit early for me. On a work, on a work week. I'm um, trying to see if there's any items over here. I think we're good. We just keep moving right on down. Oh, somebody saw me. Deflecting, okay. Right before the land. Okay, so, yeah. So it's the usual type of stuff. It's like a parry. Um, I don't know if it's the same timing as a parry, but I think it's like, it's, it's similar. Let's see if, what timing it is though. Oh no, that, ooh, that feels nice. Or dead, sir. <laughs> I like deflecting, that's pretty cool. I knew it was gonna be in the game, but it, it is pretty cool. Alright, so there's two that I can see. Let's use that stealth element, you know what I mean? Let's make it to where there's only one since this game does encourage stealth. Let's go ahead and just Metal Gear Solid ourselves over here. For a quick takedown, um, it'll it. I'm a, I'm I'm just hoping that it speeds it up. Don't have to fight as many people if we can just. Oh, there's more. Looks like there's two on that side as well. Oh, I just hope I don't start dodging. <laughs> Oh, that kind of alerted everybody. Character has so much maneuverability. Ooh, it feels really nice. Ooh, deep. 
selecting feels really nice, really nice in this game. I would give this game um, as many props as possible because I already love the Soul series. I really didn't think I was going to end up hating this game. So. <laughs> yeah, deflecting feels nice. Hmm. Can't open that door to beat up the two guys that were talking shit. The other thing I like is the fact that you can climb on stuff. You know, you're not. You don't feel as down to earth as you do in Dark Souls, where everything is kind of set up in a particular way, and you know which ways that you could go. This kind of gives you the vibe where you can go anywhere, and I know you get the grapple later on, which means I feel like the world will just completely open up and you can go anywhere and everywhere you want once you get it. So I, I think this game has a lot of promise. Um, what? Counter slashes. Deflect. After deflecting, you can land an attack. So after you land a deflect, it sounds like you're guaranteed an attack before they can recover. Um, who am I giving that a... Ooh, hello, big boy. Big boy. Ooh, that hurt. I always struggle with the slower attacks. I like quick attacks. I should really be staying on an attack anymore. I'm just afraid that my guard is going to break as well. It's not guard, uh, what is it? Posture. Posture. These are, these are one of the guys that requires uh, two death blows. Ooh, got a bit more aggressive. I like it. I actually see... I, I think I'm going to enjoy them being a little bit more aggressive, so... If that's where the game heads, I actually would prefer them to be more aggressive. It just feels easier to deflect when the enemy is a little bit more aggressive at you. Swinging and slapping and smacking his way at you. Okay. Um, oh, from the other side. So it looks like we do go this way. Heading all the way. Go ahead and Sly Cooper our way across this. It's kind of like God of War where you can see the scuff marks. You know that secret passage at the bottom of the moat, under the bridge? We just got orders to guard it. Mmm. Security's getting tight. War will be upon us very soon. Ooh, he's security getting tight, is it? Just like one of those bug things from Dark Souls. Come here, boy. Do anything, come here. Oh my god, he's one ugly motherfucker. Nothing? No, maybe... Maybe, maybe he's not. Okay. Huh, now I'm wondering if I should have even attacked him. Oh, well. Dang it. 
Alright, any other items that I'm missing? Damn. Once I have the grappling hook, I think I can do it later. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and let him know. How did he get out? Wolf, you found it. Now let us leave this place. Yes, my lord. Honestly, like how the fuck did the kid get out of the tower? To think that this is the only way I never to run the from the faded bloodline is the only answer. Where shall we go once we're away from the castle? I suppose the first thing we should do is cross the Ashina border. Or perhaps we should hide somewhere. What do you think? Whatever you desire. Whatever I desire? That's the wolf I know. My lord. <laughs> oh, nothing. I was just reminiscing. Onward, then. Oh, it's the opening cuts. It's the opening trailer. Fuck. I don't want to die. Not ready to die yet. The divine air. Last we stood together was your uncle's funeral. Lord Genichiro. I... Oh. We're going to take care of it? Is that, is that what we're doing? Thank you. Oh, snap. Leave this to me. You I know we're a shinobi, but I don't want to fight this man. I haven't learned much in the 23 minutes I played so the noble shinobi stands in our way hey, yeah let me come back after I beat the game you know once or twice and then uh let me see if I can beat you you face Genichiro Ashina <laughs> oh hello Is that all the shinobi has to offer? Fuck you. The divine heir will be coming with me. For now. Guarantee I come back and kick your ass. Asshole.
All right, after this cutscene, I'm probably going to call it for this first episode, uh, mainly because it's almost 3 in the morning. So, after we do a little bit more, I'm going to I'm gonna call it, boys. I'll play a little more tomorrow. What is this? You're straight out of Berserk, bro. So you're awake. Looks like death is not your fate. Just yet. Alright, so we got the arm. I'll probably talk to this guy real quick. And then we'll see. What do you call yourself? Your eyes. The eyes of a wolf who has failed in his duties. Or so it seems to me. That is not your concern. <laughs> Spoken like a true shinobi. I must carve the Buddha. You do what you will. Hmm. Why am I here? All I did was drag you here. Didn't even know if I was dragging a corpse. Couldn't let you get eaten by a pack of wild dogs. How long was I asleep? <laughs> Some time has passed since I found you. I see. However, your master yet lives. <clears throat> He's being held prisoner in Ashina Castle. They will soon make use of his bloodline. Looking at you, I'm sure you appreciate the value it has. My left arm. What did you do to me? That is what I call the Shinobi prosthetic. A fitting fang for a one-armed wolf. Useless when it comes to carving Buddha, though. You can have it. Shinobi prosthetic? It is no mere replacement for your lost arm. Come to me if you find any shinobi tools. Shinobi tools? I see. For this device. <laughs> you catch on quick. If you bring me shinobi tools, I'll find a way to fit them to the shinobi prosthetic. Then you'll come to appreciate its worth. I'm sure I will. Oh, what did you mean when you said they'll make use of his bloodline? I don't know much about him, except the dragon's heritage. There's a special kind of blood by that name, and that blood runs through your master's veins. So the divine heir. Someone's after him. Might be that the strange things happening to your body have something to do with that. You're quite the strange one, yet other peculiar visitors have come to this temple. There's one in the clearing to the right of the gate leading off the temple grounds. Two strangers in strange circumstances. You two might get along. Okay. You see the kind-faced Buddha there? That isn't one of mine. It was carved by the true sculptor. When a man must confront what is inside of him, it can probably be of help. Confront what is inside him? Anger, sadness, or perhaps old memories of times long gone. That kind of thing. Alright. He's done talking, so I'll go ahead and end it here, and we'll start right back up here in the next one. Thank you all for watching. Thank you everyone for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment if you did. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. If you did not, let me know why. Other than that, here are a couple videos for you guys to check out in case you did enjoy it. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.